king in Mississippi, and yeah. I really think that a lot of these boys see that as a way to get out and be successful. I think they should definitely try. Even if they're not pro, it'll take them to college. Possibly, oh, yeah. So. Oh, yeah. I have no problem with athletics at all. In fact, I do book for volleyball and basketball. Yeah. So. Um, okay, so my spinning. Um, right now, what I'm working on is the um, Color Shift BFL that I dyed at Tempted's. Stacy's. I just refer to her as Tempted. Um, I split it into three. These are two of the balls. I'm working on the other um, bump of it, part of it, whatever, downstairs on the wheel. Um, I only got maybe a quarter of an ounce spun. We started to watch where the wild things are on Friday. We didn't get past the first 20 minutes. It was so hard. It was hard to get into. It was hard to get into and I don't know. I, I, don't know. I love that book so much that it was really hard for me yeah. to get into. So then we watched The Lightning Thief which instead, was which was not very much not better. like the book. <laughs> but yeah. at least it had action and yeah. stuff. I mean, so the graphics were good. But, yeah, so we watched that and I, I didn't get very much at all spun. Um, but I did finish the red that I was spinning. I got a fingering, possibly lace in some places, two ply. It hasn't The twist hasn't been set yet or anything, so it is a little bit overspun. I'm okay with that though. Once it gets set, it'll be fine. Um, so it's a two ply. I got 530 ish yards out of it. That's what it looks like. I don't know if that's too close or too far away. I hope it's a happy medium. Um, I'm happy with the yardage. It's, I believe it's the most yardage I've got out of a four ounce so far. So it made me happy. I'll set the twist on it. No, I haven't. I'm sorry, I haven't set the twist on I'll set the twist on my, some of my other spinning last night. And you blocked some other stuff, too. Yeah, I did block some other stuff. Here, let me get it. Why are those socks down there? Because I haven't woven in the ends yet, and oh. I was going to do that while we were podcasting. Okay. But whatever. <laughs> why can't be in my business, Laura? I was just curious as to why those socks were down there. So, speaking of ends that need to be woven in... Normally I weave in my ends before I block, and I just don't cut them until after I block. See, I don't. But I wait till afterwards. For some reason I didn't on this one. This is the uh, hand-spun Lady Bertram that it's I showed y'all a few weeks ago, but it hadn't been blocked at that point, so now it's been blocked. And this is a windy pattern. I love it. It's, it's so pretty. It's very pretty, and I'm wearing another windy pattern now. That is. This is the seaside shawl. Leslie's trying to freeze me out, so... It's 74 in my house, <laughs> and apparently that is too cold for Laura. It is. Well, the ceiling fan's on, too. But we are windied out because <laughs> we're going to see Wendy. We are. Yay! <laughs> Yay! So, on Labor Day weekend, we're going to fly from Memphis to D.C., leaving at 6 a.m. so that we can get there at a decent <sighs> hour. <laughs> she sighs so dramatically. Um, but Wendy had uh, invited us after the, the fling. Um... So we are going to go and spend a couple days up with Wendy. I'm so excited that I get to go because my school is not letting us take a whole lot of time off this year. Yeah. So. And I'm, I'm surprised that I can because I work in the gaming industry and getting off on a major holiday like Labor Day is not an easy thing to do. Yeah. Because those are our busiest times because everybody's off work so they're like, well, let's go spend money at the casino. Especially because it's the first of the month and people just got paid. This is true. This yeah. is true. So... Um, that's a big holiday. I'm very excited that we get to go and see Wendy and um, hang out with Lucy. And <laughs> it's going to be fun. So we're, Throw little paper balls for yeah. Lucy to chase We after. hadn't wanted to say anything yet just because we hadn't booked tickets or anything. But we are booked and Yay. we are set to go. So we're very excited about that. We're very excited. Um, where were we? Um, speaking of Wendy, we'll just segue into Wendy. Can I do my Wendy thing real fast? I know it's supposed to be favorite things, but Whatever. we're talking about Wendy. Um, Wendy has a cow that's going to go on. I guess it's more unofficial, but she's creating a pie shawl. Oh, yes. That's something she just mentioned today, yeah, right? Okay. Uh-huh. She has an idea. And so you need to go to her, um... Blog. Blog, which is www.wendynets.net mm -hmm. for more information. But I'm going to participate. I just have to pick out the right yarn. I'm sure I have So it's going to be kind of like a mystery knit along. She's going to post parts of it yeah. at a time. Yeah, yeah. But there's no fee or anything else, because no. so, some of the mystery ones charge. But, um, yeah, so just go there for more information. I'm excited. I want to be in on it, but I have to finish the sweater, so. I thought I messed up my calendar. Yeah, Hopefully so. I'll get this done, and then I can join, and it starts next Sunday. 
I won't be able to do this one um, because I'm going to start a commission piece sometime in the next two weeks as soon as I get the yarn and that's going to take up some of my time and I'll tell y'all more about that when I start it. It'll be fun. Yeah, I'm excited about it.